Welcome back, always a treat with Brian Lesher from The Grape, and Lesher's Red Hot stops by. You do this event every year, and it's called Soups On, and, and you do it every year, and it, the, it, the turnout's great. It's always impressive the amount of people that come to support us. Yeah. Right. And if you know anything about downtown uh, Dallas, you know about the stew pot, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which serves, uh, feeds the homeless thousands of meals every day. At least a thousand every day. Yeah. All volunteer. Yeah. A, a, an amazing organization. Okay, so it is literally soups on for this fundraiser that's a week from today, right? That's right. Yeah. And I've invited about uh, a dozen of my chef friends to come. We all bring a signature soup. Mm -hmm. And uh, the idea is that something as simple as soup can generate a lot of support from a, yep. lot, of, a lot of folks who want to help uh, yeah. Dallas's homeless clients. Okay, so what, what are you making today? Just a very simple sausage, kale, and white bean soup. Okay. Um, we've got some carrot, celery, and onions that we're just kind of sweating here. I'm going to add some. Is that some, how every soup starts? <laughs> I think a lot of the good ones. Yeah, a lot of the good you know, ones. Uh, we're going to put some crushed red chilies in there and some, some garlic and let that. The crushed red chilies, that's why I want to sneeze right now, right? Yeah, definitely. You maced me. Right. <laughs> and then uh, we're going to put some kale in here. Everybody's nuts about kale. And that'll cook down. And kale's one of those things that, yeah, it does. It reduces significantly in size, but uh, it takes on the flavors. Some fresh Italian sausage. Yeah. And where would that come from? Mm. Lusher's Red Hot. Oh, how about that? All of it made, hand, made by hand locally. Yeah, which is in the Deep Ellum area. If you haven't tried it, definitely need to stop by. So we're going to cook this down. Once it's reduced and kind of sauteed, we're going to add some, a can of diced tomatoes. Some cannellini beans, you know, and if you don't like uh, or don't want meat or sausage, you could definitely put some mushrooms in here. Yeah. And uh, I've, I've said this before with making these soups, you could just absolutely take all of this and dump it in the pot and turn it on and it's going to come out pretty good. We'll have to stock. Is that chicken stock? Chicken or? stock. Okay. We're going to bring it up to a boil, reduce to a simmer, and cook for about 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. And then that's it. Season with salt and pepper. Perfect. And then. Is this our final product? Magic. Now, uh, how, how, whenever the, the, all the chefs that come up with their different ideas, is it, are you guys trying to top one another, like when it comes to the different uh, you know, ideas on little, what kind of soup they're going to bring? There's a little friendly bring? competition. I was about to say, there has to be, right? You know, it's, it's kind of a couple of winks and, you know, look at what uh, chef's doing over here. But, uh, and it's a ton of fun. Now, where is it? Union Station. At Union Station, oh. uh, just a beautiful building. It is. Beautiful building. Great it's a great venue. And um, the staff there very hospitable yeah and it's 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 a great event because it is in kind of proximity to whom we serve right right and easy to get to because you can take dart you can take the tre absolutely you can get there however you need to get there a lot of folks will just walk from downtown offices but it's it's a lot of fun it's a big event it's a great event collins tui is our keynote speaker oh and uh it's all very entertaining mm -hmm. and we generate uh a lot of of um Donations and, yeah. and help for our for our clients. A lot of money and it goes a long way. It helps they a lot of people. Definitely know yep. how to put that money to good use. So we'll put all the information about soups on on the website, fox4news.com, as well as this recipe. Thanks for sharing. You bet. Absolutely. We'll be right back. We're gonna check your forecast and more straight ahead. And good day.